Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I have in my hand the Xiaomi Mi Mix. Uh, this is by far one of the most anticipated devices I wanted to see here at the event. Other than the new devices that was released, this device is only available in the Asian market. But one of the main, really main benefits here is the almost bezel-less display that goes all the way to the top with the 6.4 inch HD display. There's a lot of nice specs, a lot of nice little tricks that this device can do. Let's go ahead and check it out. First thing, as I mentioned, we have a 6.4 inch 1080p display. The other thing that we have right on the box here is this is running the MIUI interface version 8.0. This is the beta version running over Android 6.0. So no Android 7 at this point, but hopefully we'll see that in the near future. Uh, we are running a uh, Snapdragon 821 processor clocked in at 2.35. We do have six gigabytes of RAM. This, this is the year of six gigabytes and higher and built-in storage of 256 gigabytes of internal storage of 243 are available for us to use. Um, of course, here as far as the, the setup and what we're using here, this is a skinned version of Android. You're going to get still the same, some of the main benefits of what you get from Android 6.0. Uh, all the setup, Wi-Fi, connectivity, display, wallpaper, theme, setup, sound vibration, lock screen, notification status bar, um, second space. Uh, this is the ability to be able to use a second uh, device. So it's a create a separate space on your phone using a second space like having two devices. Essentially kind of creating it like a private side to be able to separate different things, especially if you share your device. Battery performance, storage, additional settings here. We'll go ahead and that. Uh, we have child mode, uh, privacy, uh, quick ball, screenshot, notification light. The notification light, by the way, is positioned right there at the bottom. And we do have the camera sitting on the bottom right. So the front facing camera, the five megapixel camera is at the front, where at the back we have the 16 megapixel camera with dual tone LED flash. Uh, we have a volume rocker on the right and a power button and no additional buttons on the top other than this uh, three and a half millimeter headphone jack with microphone. The SIM card tool is right here on the side. On the bottom we have USB Type-C with bottom firing speakers. Very nice, very quick, feels very snappy in the hand. The battery that we have on this device is 4400 milliamps and it should be able to uh, power the device quite well and it also does support Quick Charge 3.0 since we have the Snapdragon 821 on this unit. Um, high quality audio with 24-bit resolution so hopefully we'll be looking at a really good DAC built into this unit, GPS, NFC, all the different connectivity that you'd expect from a device. But again, the main thing that you really cannot go around, and it's, as it goes into this loop of a demo mode, you'll notice that it's just amazingly, it's, the, the bezels on this thing is almost non-present. And the fact that they condensed everything down to this side, and that the audio resonates through the actual ceramic build of this device into the ear is amazing. It's just definitely very nice. A Play Store services, all of those things are installed. Definitely very excited about this. It's going to be selling for about $578 US, um, and it's available currently in the Asian market, but you can definitely look it up online. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Like and subscribe as usual. I'll see you guys in the next one.